Hey everyone, it's Matt with MicroPDM. I have more new MicroPDM features to show. These will be coming later this summer. So our goal with the new version of the MicroPDM is to really start making it the most modular power distribution system for motorsport on the planet. So let me walk through how we do that. So as always, start with the primary module. This is the central brain. Plug in your keypad. Right, just to show that there's nothing up my sleeve here, I've got a development module plugged in over here in this busman box. And just as usual, you can see that I've got it wired up to some LEDs. And okay, we've got the seven outputs that come with the primary module. So that's all well and good. What happens if you want to expand? Okay, so other systems, you know, not to name names, but they make expansion pretty hard, right? You've got to kind of label your keypads a certain way in terms of the IDs. You got to jump through some hoops to get that done. With ours, all you have to do, make sure they're different IDs. It doesn't matter what they are. It doesn't matter what kind of keypad they are. Uh, for the most part, as long as it's, you know, one of the uh, Blink Marine PKP series, it should work fine with the new version of the Micro PDM. And it's just plug and play, right? You just take it, you just plug it in. The Micro PDM is smart enough. It detects the keypads on the bus. It detects their sizes. It detects how to send the right message to them, and it just works, right? It's automatic. So there is no app to load. There is no software to install. There is no reconfiguration you have to do. Just plug it in, it just works, right? Off the same Micro PDM. So that'll let you upgrade the number of buttons you have. It's right? super, super easy, basically plug and play. Okay, but what if you want to upgrade the number of outputs? And that's where the add-on modules come into play. So with our current version, you can just plug in one of these for a total of 14. But our customers said, hey, I want to continue to expand beyond 14. All right, so let me show you how we're doing that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring in this box that's got an add-on module plugged into it. So add-on module in one of these little sockets here. I've got uh, it's eight. It's got, excuse me, seven outputs are running to these seven LEDs. The other end of it just has power ground, can high, can low. So I've just plugged it into my CAN bus, and now. I've got another seven outputs. I've got to grab my other keypad here, and there we go. Now what happens if I want to expand even more? Okay, well I've got more buttons available. Let's get some more outputs. So I'm going to grab yet another add-on module, and again, this auto configures. There's nothing, there's no additional configuration. The MicroPDM primary module is smart. It will detect this on the bus. And I've just got it plugged into can high, can low, power and ground, and my output's running to these LEDs. And now I've got another seven outputs. And you can do this for up to three add-on modules and 28 outputs. So just to recap, you start with a single micro PDM primary module and a keypad. If you want to expand, just add some more keypads. Super easy. If you want to expand your outputs, just add these add-on modules, plug them in. The primary module detects all this, it acts as the central brain, and you're off and running. You get all the features of the micro PDM, right? but now with 28 outputs. So hopefully that gives you a taste of what's to come uh, with the new micro PDM. Again, think modular. Thanks.